Deep in the brain, there is a tiny organ about the size of a lentil called the pineal gland. It gets its name from its pine cone shape. Descartes once called it the seat of the soul, and many ancient cultures referred to it as the third eye. The pineal gland acts as the body's light sensor. When darkness falls, it releases melatonin. This hormone triggers sleep, slows metabolism, supports cellular repair, and works as a powerful antioxidant linked to healthy aging. But there is a problem. Blue light from phones, tablets, and LED screens suppresses melatonin production. Over time, this can lead to chronic fatigue and hormonal imbalance. Biologists have also uncovered something remarkable. The pineal gland evolved from a structure known as the parietal eye. This was a light-sensitive third eye that still exists in some lizards and the tuatara. In that sense, the pineal gland resembles a vestigial eye buried deep inside the brain. As we age, or with excessive fluoride exposure, the pineal gland can calcify. When this happens, its function gradually declines. And here's the fascinating part. Some researchers suggest that the pineal gland may produce N, N, dimethyltryptamine. This is a powerful psychedelic molecule that causes profound changes in perception and conscious awareness. Because of this, some scientists speculate that it could be linked to mystical experiences. The pineal gland is our biological clock, and possibly much more. Do you sleep in complete darkness or with the lights on?